Even if you have eliminated all sources of elemental mercury at your school, and your school is mercury-free, there is always a possibility that a student could bring mercury to your school and cause a spill. Planning and preparation can minimize the health and financial consequences resulting from a spill. ATSDR's Don't Mess With Mercury website provides information and resources that can help your school become mercury free. It can also help you develop a mercury spill response plan if a spill does occur. First, fill out a mercury contact sheet listing whom to contact should a spill occur at your school. Be sure school staff is trained to know the steps to follow when responding to a mercury spill. Another important upfront action your school can take is to make a mercury spill kit. A checklist found on the website lists the supplies that you need to include in the kit. Spill kits can only be used to clean up small spills, like spills that happen when a small thermometer or fluorescent tube breaks. If your school has a bigger spill, no one should try to use a spill kit to clean it up. That's a job for trained professionals only.